Hello and welcome back to Lord Fent Gaming Plays Wasteland Remastered. I'm your host Lord Fent and today's Wasteland Remastered video right here. We're finally in Las Vegas and we're going to do a lot of things in Vegas. First of all, what we're going to do is uh, go ahead and look for Sonic Keys and Loot. Get some passwords. Also go into Space Casino. Mess that up a bit. Meet Fat Freddy. And also get a new companion to replace Felicia. As always, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more Wasteland videos like this. And do not forget to hit that notification bell to be updated on my videos and more. Now, please note on my character's experience, this is before the experience method I did. Yeah. As soon as I uh, got done with Vegas, I decided to look for new ways to gain experience points. Please consult that video, though. But for now, I'm going to give everybody a quick update on the between uh, that video and the Needles one. Yeah, I did gain some skills, a whole lot in gambling though. Everybody has gambling because that's another way to get some experience points too. So first thing we're going to do after I look at my characters is we're going to get a, a password. Yeah, this is for uh, Fat Freddy later on because I feel this is important. So you go inside this abandoned building like I am. There's a bum here. Yeah, you have to uh, give him money. Yeah, give the bum money and then start typing a few words. Like for example, tip and then after that. Fat Freddy, yeah, I spelled, I think I spelled that wrong. Oh, no, it's Farron uh, Brago. Yeah, type that in. That's good right here. Uh, Covenant, that's our uh, character we're going to recruit later on. It's the same thing now. Fat Freddy, there you go. Password is uh, Bird here. That's uh, very important. Yeah, and there's one more I think I was supposed to uh, type. Let me uh, see here. I'm supposed to do one more and then it does trigger an update, which you do want that because if you don't get that update, yeah. And this one's Death Machine right here. Okay, I think I spelled that wrong. Let's see if this is it. Max, type the word Max in and there you go. We got ourselves a mission update, Trouble in Vegas. So guess what? We're going to be facing a lot of robots and if you have a good uh, assault rifle skills, you're a... Uh, you're set. If not, you have to find other ways to feed them because they are tough. And yeah, brawling will start to be uh, less attractive until you get a proton axe. Now, if you are noticing uh, during my uh, trips through Vegas, I'm using different ways to enter. Well, they're shortcuts. So first thing we're going to do is go to this temple right here towards this humanoid. However, we're going to face our first robot in Las Vegas here. Now, after the robots, we're going to clear out the front door for now. That temple will be for the next video, so let's go ahead and clear this uh, out. Well, on my test run, that guy did drop something. Yeah, RNG kind of screwed me on that. But oh well, we uh, cleared the front gate to this uh, nuclear reactor, which is now a temple, which is very scary here. If one of those uh, cultists gets that to work, yeah, Las Vegas gets blown up again. That's not cool. Still, what we're going to do is collect the sonic keys now. Yeah, so we're going to look for, I believe, two combats to do this. And then we're going to actually dig one up before we hit one of the uh, casinos. Yeah. This is going to be like a run around part portion of the video right here to get those Sonic keys. 
again, I'll put timestamps in the video so this way people will uh, know where to find them. So first thing we're going to do is uh, clear out these tanks here. These tanks. Yes, this is cool right here. We defeated that foe here. We're going after Cyborg Commandos here. They're holding Sonic Keys and more loot. So let's go ahead and uh, kill these uh, robots. Yes, we defeated it. That is one Sonic Key. Kevlar suit. That's another one here. Here's the thing. I'm still keeping the radiation suits because I need one more in case I do need to go into a radiate area. Still, this is like really uh, cool here. Yeah. Some AIK weapons. This is all really nice. Seriously, this is really nice. Now we're going for the second one. I'm going to be running around a few times. Yeah, because we're going to be facing a foe that's really tough. Yeah, let's be honest here. This foe right here, the Scorpotron, I think it's called, or some kind of giant scorpion robot-like creature. Yeah, we're going to avoid it because we don't have the proper weapons or, and the proper armor. Yeah, this is more like, uh, yeah, let's see how f far we can run away. Again, I'm using the same method right here to go in out of Vegas, but first we're going to rest up. Look for somewhere that's very hot. Yeah, if it's extremely hot, yeah, guess what, my friends? You're going to rest up. Nobody's going to bug you, which is really good. So what we're going to have to do is go back into Vegas. Yeah, and we're going to do another uh, shortcut method instead of just running through the entire uh, city and getting uh, mauled by robots. So let's go ahead and uh, check over here. Looks like we have taken care of the tanks for now, hopefully. <laughs> yeah, still here's the neat thing about this game. You can reload your clips before combat, which is really uh, good right here. I'm equipping a few rockets here you know, just in case I have to face a certain amount of these uh, robots and uh, cyborgs. Yeah, they are tougher here. Still, it's very tough. I probably will have to uh, stock up on more of these uh, rockets eventually. So it looks like this is it right here for now. So let's go over here. Okay, scavengers. They're very easy to kill. Now the human uh, targets here, they're really simple to kill. I mean, let's be honest here, folks. One, two shots from your AR weapons, especially if you're higher up in the skill right here, you're good. Let's keep on going here and keep on moving. Okay, Scorpotrons avoid at all car costs because they hit hard. I'm still trying to look for the one uh, robot here because he has the second key here that's why I have to search around here yeah it's not easy to uh, find and by the way mines will sometimes level up, level up your perception to four if you're lucky I have it done on a test run and that was good this video not so much 
So I am still going to try to look for uh, more of these robots here. Yeah, I'm still trying to look for them. And I'm just going to keep on looking. Okay, everything looks fine for now. I have a bunch of power packs. This is very uh, good. Uh, another bunch of scavengers I have to uh, take care of. These guys are really easy. I mean, come on, they're really simple. Yeah, one or two shots from your AR weapon should do it. Or have your other characters wail on them. And avoid this guy. Yeah, see, I went the wrong way. And that's where you want to avoid. And then one of those choppers here. So, yeah, these choppers are uh, easy, uh, too, to kill. Now, the next set of enemies are not so easy. Yeah, they are the uh, tanks 3.0. And they can level up your weapons to uh, level 4. You're going to see that in a few moments, which is really cool. Now at this point, I'm trying to go the right way, unfortunately. 
Yeah, I'm going the wrong way, but still, this is a learning experience right here. I'm showing everybody you could actually level up some of your uh, weapons to threes and fours here, which is very uh, good. Yeah, I'm going to have to run from the Scorpatron again, and then I'll probably have to fight my way out. I'm going to try another route while I try to get my perception up to uh, four, which that is not happening with the mines here, but still, we're going to just keep on going. I'm going to have to clear this uh, set of foes out after running from the Scorpatron right here. The foe that I am not going to face. Now, let's get out of Las Vegas back into the wasteland right here. Yeah, we're going to use the enter and exit method. Before we actually do that, we'll just heal up one more time and go one more way and see if I can find the second key. Good news is I'm leveling up my assault rifles to three to four, which is really good. You want to do that, especially here, because you're going to be using them a lot. I have a feeling until you get something better like energy weapons. That's why I got everybody uh, energy weapons up. Now, these are the foes right here. Key number two. Yes, that's number two right here. We're going to grab it. Ooh, this is nice right here. More, uh, we call it bullets and, of course, another uh, AK weapon. So now our next stop right here is this uh, golf course. After I'm done looting, we're going to use the uh, exit and enter method again. Different side of Vegas. So we avoid walking around the town. Yeah, I should say city. Now this next method right here is random to get the third key right here. Oh yes, it is so uh, random. I mean, I'm serious. It is seriously uh, random. So let me explain uh, how this goes. There are two loop pools, your uh, rocket launchers or the uh, sonic key might be both. I did a test run of this. I got one or the other. Yeah, I'm going for the sonic key because I feel like I could get the uh, rocket launchers later on. That's probably uh, somewhere like um, at that temple or uh, somewhere. So you go to a golf course right here. Now, once you get this message right here, that's where you dig. Here's my advice. Make a save before you dig because it's random. Yeah. Make sure you have your luckiest character uh, to actually loot it up. So I already made my save here. It says it looks like something is buried here. So we're going to use a shovel. Make sure you bring a shovel. And there you go. We got the sonic key. Yeah, it was either a Sonic Key or Rocket Launchers, but I want the uh, Sonic Key because I feel like that's important here. Seriously, it felt like it's really important. Okay, all three keys are done. We're going to Spades Casino right here to get a password. Yeah, we're going to go there. Now there's a gambling table right there. You'll be able to gamble until you actually uh, do something bad. Yeah. So what we're going to do right now is actually split a party member up, sit by the bar, and then afterwards, it will uh, trigger a cutscene. We'll get ourselves a nice password. We're going to use that in the next video, this uh, password. So let's go ahead and do it. Hi, they call me Crumb, he says with anonymous head. After he exchanges handshakes with everybody, he tells you, Seafair and Brigo, he's my boss. Be sure to use the password Kestrel. As you leave, he yells, tell him I sent you. 
now we have met crumb here you think we're uh, done here oh no we're gonna clear out the joint here upstairs for experience points and more and we're also going to do uh, on our way out scare ourselves our first energy weapon which is a laser pistol so we're going to do some BE right here, break it entry. We're not going to blow up the uh, door here. We're going to save the TNT for the uh, rest of that. So we're done right there. So let's go ahead and do this right now. Do some breaking and entry here. Yeah, we're going to do it. If I cannot, I'm just going to blow open the door here at this point. And I'm going to try to search everywhere. Yeah, I'm searching everywhere. It looks like it's nothing there. This is like really uh, cool. Yeah, we're going to kill uh, two NPCs, and then I'm going to show everybody a good way to get uh, climb four. Yeah. So we're going to open this door up. Once we are done opening this door up via lockpick or explosives, we're going to be facing a foe up ahead. So let's go ahead and open and face them. Well, Cutie is dead, so let's see what she has. Okay, that is not bad. That's decent cell loot right here. That's uh, good right here. Thank you, Cutie, for the money. Seriously. Now, next up, we're going to face Al right here. Yeah, we're going to clear this floor out of uh, mafia-type people here. Yeah, I'm just going to do it for uh, experience and fun. Yeah, this was before the uh, method I uh, shown but still, this is like really fun. It's my excuse to kill people. I mean, come on. This game is really fun doing that. Let's be honest. Red Rider was fun to kill. And many others. So we'll go over here. Once we get in this room right here, Al is not going to be happy to see us. And we have to uh, kill him. Well, look like Al is dead here. Let's see what he has. Let's look at really uh, quick. Uh, just your standard. Uh, yeah, you can sell that to uh, a vendor in needles or a uh, quartz here. Okay, we're going to do next is besides attempting to open this door here via pick locks here, which by the way, I'm at level five. Yeah, this is a great spot for uh, picking locks here in uh, Las Vegas. That's why I'm doing it too. So this way later on, if there's any more uh, doors for me to do that, yeah, I'll do it. And I had to blow up the door. Besides, I have so much TNT at this point. I have a lot of TNT. Yeah, this is like my get out of jail free card. So, this point right here, use your rope right here. Then use your climb skill. I heard you could get climb to four here. I am not certain, but that's the uh, rumor. But then again, you're in uh, Las Vegas, so that could happen. Now, this is the area where you meet Crumb right here for a meeting right here. He gave you a password to visit his boss, Brian... Uh, if I go or whatever it is, the uh, mob boss here. We're going to be visiting one of them, which is uh, Fat Freddy uh, next. But for now, I'm going to attempt to open this door here. I think there's nothing here. Besides, I just need to clear out inventory space. I've been stockpiling TNT like crazy. I think it's time to use a few of them up. Again, use your uh, climb skill to uh, get up. Yep, yeah, there you go. Now, next part right here, we're going to go downstairs. Clear out these uh, enemies here in order to get to the uh, other enemy.
Now, because of that, I sacrificed the Aaron scent in order to uh, get to this guy right here. He has a laser pistol, your first energy weapon of the game right here. It's very important you start uh, getting uh, weapons like laser pistols and uh, more. Seriously, it is important. So next up, we're going to do right now is go ahead and kill this fool right here and have some fun doing so. So let's do it. Okay, we got ourselves a nice laser pistol right here, another uh, power pack, and a Kevlar suit here. This is uh, really uh, good. Now, the thing is, I'm still saving the rad suits because you may never know. I'm still missing one rad suit because I do need another one eventually. At least if I could get, I say, probably seven rad suits, that will be uh, great. Now, because the uh, act I did in the casino here... Yeah, I'm not allowed to uh, gamble, except for using the slot machines. Yeah, unfortunately, I've been banned from the tables here. Oh, well, there's a better place. That's called uh, Needles, and I think it's Fat Freddy's is a better place to actually make some decent money. Yeah, even though if I separate the characters, yeah, I'm not allowed to do it. But, oh, well, that was fun, though. <laughs> I cleared everything out. Seriously, that was, like, really fun. Okay, we're done with Spades Casino here. Our uh, next destination after I'm trying to attempt to uh, gamble here is uh, Fat Freddy's. Yeah, that's the place you want to go to uh, next because Fat Freddy's going to give you a, a mission to uh, kill his rival. Which I'm just going to grab it, but I'm not going to do it because I want to keep my uh, stance with uh, the crime boss's neutral for now. So this enemy right here is a guard leader. Very easy to uh, kill. Do not become hostile. Once you are done killing him, you'll be able to go inside. All I'm going to do is uh, post the uh, password up once the, this guy is uh, dead. So let's see the password. Now we're inside Fat Freddy's here. There's another uh, place to gamble. I'll show that another time. Password is bird here. If you type the other one, that's the uh, wrong one. Where, yeah, you get punched, but the correct word is bird. Bird is the word. Now once you get that right... Now, next up, we're going to go talk with Fat Freddy. He's going to give us a mission to kill his rival, so let's just hear him out. Fat Freddy is a genetic nightmare, a squamous mash of slimy flesh, shuddering and twitching before you like some animated blob of flesh-colored jello. He smells like a swamp, a foul, choking miasma of rotting Mastodonian flesh left to putrefy. His presence is overwhelming. Perhaps he has some mutant ability to control men's minds. While in his presence, you have to sternly control an urge to salute or kneel. There's no doubt that he is a leader of men. When he speaks, his voice sounds like bubbles of carbon dioxide burbling up out of a morass. It's difficult to understand him, but after the first few phrases of introduction, you begin to get the hang of it. Fat Freddy is a man driven by ambition, and he has an offer to make. Brigo thinks he controls Vegas, grumbles Freddy, but he isn't half the man I am. <laughs> this should be my town, and it will be. I've had your men watched since you got to Vegas. They tell me you're the best fighters ever seen in these parts. Well, then it shouldn't be too tough for you to do me a favor. Kill Fair and Brigo, and bring me the onyx ring he always wears. When you do that, I'll give you $25,000 and anything else you want in this town. You tell him that you need a few minutes to think things over, and go into a corner to confer among yourselves. You have a very strong feeling that Freddy doesn't want to hear any negatives out of you. Okay, we got ourselves a mission from Fat Freddy. I am not going to perform this mission yet. I don't feel like I should be able to do it now. Now, if I have a choice to do it, yeah, I'll do it probably. If not, yeah, I might portray the dude. But still, $25,000 is like a lot. And if you're going for that uh, achievement where you need uh, 50000 uh, well, this is a good start. That's halfway there already. And this is a gambling table. It's probably going to have to have a gambling, uh, say, uh, above 10 in order to do well in it. Now, our next stop right here is actually the jail. Yeah, th you heard me. It is the uh, jail. We will have to face some robots on the way out, like this one up ahead.
that is the last of the robots we're going to fight. Again, we're going to use the uh, shortcut method and still going around the long way. And this is the jail right here, very close by. Now, here's the thing right here. You do need to do is empty out your character's inventory here of the ones you want to ditch. Yeah, seriously. So I did it real quick on Felicia's inventory right here. Yeah, she's all done. Now this door up ahead, you need uh, this arm right here. Yeah, you do need that because if you uh, decide to lockpick or blow it up, yeah, enemies will come. I decided not to deal with the foes. Yeah, just got to keep on trying it. Just use the uh, disarm alarm right here and the door is open. Watch out for the electricity. You will uh, take damage. And we're going to open the door up. Now next part right here, you need pick lock right here. My character has five in pick lock. I think you need strength in order to break him free too. And there you go right here. He's already uh, ready. I forgot to ditch uh, Felicia. I forgot to tell her bye Felicia. Go back to Needles. Go back to your husband and your son. Your uh, services is over. And yeah, thank you very much. Seriously. Thank you uh, very much for your uh, service. Being our CPR dummy. Yeah. She's a perfect CPR dummy. But her usefulness has been lived out. So what we're going to do right now is get in the combat. But hire instead. Covenant will uh, join us, and, and after that, we'll uh, get out of here, and I'll end the video outside of uh, Vegas. So, this is like a pretty good day right here, despite the fact we face a lot of robots to gain a lot of skill-ups, which is really uh, good here. And I think his stuff is here. Make sure you give Covenant a canteen. If not, yeah, you're going to have to keep on reviving him, and the desert is hot. Yeah, this is, uh, this is the Arizona... Nevada slash California area. It, it's hot, very hot, especially in this game right here. And what we're going to do is right now is give uh, Felicia stuff to uh, Covenant here because he deserves it. So, in all, let me uh, give a good review on what happened in today's video. First of all, we did was we got some information and a password. We got three Sonic keys. And then after that, we visit Spades Casino and wrecked it up. We met Fat Freddy. And finally, we free someone from jail. In our next video, we're going to meet the other boss, go inside the Mushroom Temple, and get our first Proton Axe. Well, this is it for my Wasteland Remastered video. This is Lord Fenton signing off. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day or night.